you need to know the, the family themselves, first of all. Her father, her mother, her brother, her sisters. So then you need to know the girl more. And we have something called engagement period. You go and meet the girl, but you don't. <laughs> now you go to her family house, proud, knocking the door. You are not afraid of anyone. Not sneaking here and there and texting during the night and meeting the other day. No. Go in a normal way, knock the door, go and sit down with the girl or someone in her family. Ask whatever questions you want. Not for one time, two times, three times, four times, five times. But don't go alone together. Then the shaitan, let me hold your hands, we are crossing the road. <laughs> so, you need someone to be there to observe your behavior and help you. All of you, you do it? <laughs> Okay, this question is about uh, smoking. It says, is smoking haram? What about shisha? I don't think shisha is worse than a cigarette. <laughs> the worst, the, for me, this is a personal, this is not a fatwa, yeah? this is a personal opinion. The worst action for the human being to do is to smoke. You know why? First of all, you're affecting your health. You're giving them, them your money. And what's your benefit from this smoking? Nothing. Killing yourself, giving your money out, not spend it on your family or on some something good, and there is no benefit from that. So what you gain from smoking is nothing. Just to say that I am a enough. I'm more than 18, because you know the legal uh, age to sell the tobacco is 18. So you want to prove that you are over 18, so you smoke in the street. Smoking is very, very bad, especially for women. It's bad for men. Shisha is more worse because you're smoking the sense of the water. So you're killing yourself 10 times quicker than this cigarette. This is the, what they said. Please. Right. This question is about uh, belief. How, brothers, you know, we're all in here together. It's getting hot. So, how can I believe in a God if I cannot see Him? You can see everything. <laughs> can you see everything? No. Definitely not. Show me where is the electricity in the cables. You see the effects of the electricity. So all these human being here around you, it is not enough. There is a creator. All these trees in the garden here, all the same. The same cells, all made for mood, but this one produces mangoes, the other one produces apples, the other one produces oranges, and so on. So he, who made them? There is the Creator, there is a God. So this is an old question. Long time ago, they asked it to Imam al Hanifa, rahimahullah. They said, "Proof, there is a God for us." Because we don't see it. We don't see it. Imam of Hanifa he said, show me your brain. Show me your brain. I cannot see your brain. That mean it is empty box there at the top. Or oh, there's something. He said, no, there is something. He said, it is a very basic uh, information for a man or a woman she is living or he is living in 2009. Okay, this is a bit of a serious question. Is it allowed to have abortions under certain circumstances, for example, rape? Uh, when a woman, this is in general, yeah? When a woman, she gets pregnant, it is haram from day one to take that baby away. 
this baby is not belong to you. Even if you are raped, you are killing a human being. Now sometimes, sometimes, we ask three different doctors to say this pregnancy is danger for the women. So we say, after three statements from three different doctors, this is Islamically, then we pass the fatwa, yes, you can do this operation. Other than that, it is not allowed, even whatever the circumstances. If it is from adultery, you carry the circumstances. You carry the result, because you follow your desire, not your brain. So you need to face the consequences. Right? Abortion is totally haram in Islam. Totally haram in Islam. Okay, this is a question of um, birth control. Is it halal to have relations with a man or a woman with a no, relations with a woman with a condom, for example, with your wife? And is it allowed to use birth control in Islam? With your wife, wife, wife. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is permissible for a certain time for a valid reason. Like, for example, she get married, but she wants to finish her studies. There is one year or two years left. And yes, she can use contraceptions. Other than that, the most beautiful moment is when you have a baby. So. some day-to-day -day questions now. Um, is it allowed to get your belly button pierced? <laughs> well, for a woman, she, if she's a, a Muslim, she's covering her body, so what's the benefit from that? If he's a man, you are mature enough not to do it. <laughs> okay, um, it's a political one. As a Muslim, how can I defend my religion when people come, when people come on to me with all terrorism issues? Are they real Muslims? First of all, we are here, I don't know how, what's the number here, roughly? 200? 200. Sitting together, laughing together, listening together, learning together. Anyone is beating the other? Terrorist is something that is being made outside, not in here. Muslims and Islam, if we understand the word of Islam and Muslims, Peace, peace. There, there's no words to explain it. So anyone will come to the issues of, to you, say to him what I've done to you. Because this is a, 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 what we call it, a, a basic understanding. I will not be convicted for someone's mistake. If someone has done a wrong, I'm not, well, I'm, I will not carry this his response or, or his mistake. The same, if you walk here in this and there is someone you've done a crime a few yards from you, police will not arrest you and take you because that man you've done that crime. So basic answer for this a very uh, what we call it serious question. This is Islam the Prophet Allah they told us how to behave with the people, to invite them to Islam, not to kill. If you read the Prophet ﷺ biography, if you read his life from day one to the end of his life, the Prophet ﷺ, the most merciful person on the earth, to the human being, not to the Muslim side. Back to the marriage issue. Um, what if you get proposals from from men that are of different race to yourself? 
but your parents say no because they want you to marry someone from the same race. This issue is it's not allowed in Islam. Race and not race, black and white, yellow and blue. This is this does not exist in Islam. For me personally, lots of people they ask me about these questions about my daughter. I said I have no restrictions, just one one issues 